Welcome to Vicarious. Uh, this is uh, Philomena, my crew, uh, chef, hostess, and I am Austin, captain. Uh, we're uh, a new crew, but uh, we have experience in uh, charters, so we'd love to show you the boat and tell you about ourselves. Mm -hmm. um, out here we have seating for uh, up to eight. Uh, we typically run six pack, however. Um, our seating indoor and outdoor can, can seat eight. Uh, we have um, ample room back here. Uh, this is a uh, electric uh, fridge bench uh, that uh, we typically sit on if we're invited to eat dinner with the, with the guests. And uh, walking around the boat, uh, you can see that the flooring is the composite flexi teak. It's soft on the feet and feels nice. Uh, it doesn't get that hot. The uh, tender we have back here, uh, it's a 12-foot inflatable uh, with a 25-horsepower engine. It's uh, pretty good for towing uh, kids on our uh, water toys. We have a lot of different ones to show you. Um, in the uh, uh, walk around for the boat, uh, this Leopard 48 has the flush mount hatches, uh, so there's less opportunity for stubbing your toe, uh, but still no running on deck. Uh, one hand for the boat. Uh, the, uh, the, the water toy department, uh, you can see up here, we have uh, inflatable paddle boards, uh, three of them, uh, different sizes. Uh, we have water skis, wakeboard, uh, the comfortable life jackets uh, that don't chafe, and, uh, you know, blue and pink, boy and girl, you know, whoever wants to wear what. But uh, we have a foil board. Uh, it's a surf foil, so that means you're uh, foiling at low speeds uh, as opposed to a kite foil, uh, which is kind of dangerous, actually. Uh, these ones uh, will typically wear a helmet and an impact life vest. Uh, when we're taking crew out, um, I mean guests, and uh, uh, here you can see this big donut, and what that is, it's made out of a hypalon material, uh, just like your stand-up paddle boards. Uh, it's a mesh net inside. It creates a wading pool effect, uh, so whether you want to sit in it or put your uh, young, you know, novice swimmer in there, so parents can sit around the edge and keep an eye on them and have a cold one, keep it in the cup holder right there. Uh, it works really well for that, and uh, we keep them inflated, really easy to deploy. We can uh, get the life, the uh, we can get the toys in the water in like 10 minutes, uh, typically. So they're easy to go. Uh, we have an inflatable uh, tube here, two-person tube. Uh, a lot of fun uh, with this. Uh, it's kind of goofy, but but it but it's it's enjoyable. Um, over on the dock there, you can see if we were planning a beach day, uh, we have a uh, shaded tent, uh, shovels and cooler, little uh, little stereo system as well to bring out and uh, make it a nice day for people. Uh, so instead of going back around the other side of the boat, we can come in through the uh, forward access, which is kind of unique to the Leopards. Uh, Sitting up here is uh, really, really nice uh, to have either a sundowner or a cup of coffee uh, in the morning. It's very private. Uh, it gets good breeze if you're on the hook. Uh, you're always pointing into the wind. Uh, accessing it uh, is um, through this uh, door here. With uh, it's very, uh, very safe. It's got uh, you can dog it down with uh, three big latches there. Um, so, uh, we've never really had any uh, water problems, but uh, uh, unique to the leopards. Now we can show you the inside of the boat. This is our galley where we cook all sorts of meals, everything from vegan food to Mediterranean food, and be proud of that. Yep. This is our table. It does open and fold out into a full dining room table in case it's raining or the guests would just like to eat inside. Yep, uh, in the air, yep. Get a higher or we can even raise it or lower it to be a 
coffee table or even a fold out bed for kids or a comfy movie night. So that's pretty exciting. Yep. And uh, we can take you down onto, so this is a four cabin layout. Uh, crew is, are up in the forward starboard side. Um, so we have three cabins, queen beds. And um, so if we take you down on the port side, it's a mirror image to what the starboard side would see. Um, come down below here, and uh, if you go aft, uh, you'll see one of the queen beds. Um, and uh, the way we have this made up is the um, boat mattress foam, which is six inches. On top of that, then we carry a, a gel mattress pad, uh, three inch memory foam. Uh, then on top of that is a little, um, not before the, uh, First uh, fitted sheet, it's a uh, little uh, pillow type top type of thing. And uh, our, uh, our our guests this season are getting Nalgene's um, water bottles uh, that they get to keep. Uh, we brand them with our logo, with our sticker. And uh, throughout the week, uh, we'll have the water infused, you know, lemon or cucumber uh, available, nice and cold, where they can uh, refill their bottles and stay hydrated for the vacation um, and they take it home with them. Uh, these rooms have good storage. Uh, there are, uh, pl there's plenty of closet space uh, for hanging coats. Uh, we have two drawers underneath each bed, uh, one, you know, typically per person and uh, they come right out. Well, you, can see, you can see our, uh, our linen kits that we change halfway through the charter. They're vacuum sealed ready to go for a quick changeover. Oopsies. Uh, in our heads here, uh, these are uh, enclosed. Uh, there's uh, electric flush uh, heads. Um, the uh, uh, shower is a uh, separate stall right there. Uh, we have uh, soap provided. Uh, however, you know, guests can bring on their special uh, kits as well. Um, they're, uh, they're, they're good showers. Water, good, good water pressure. Very important. <laughs> uh, up forward, you can see we have uh, a similar layout, but uh, you know the pointy end is a little more narrow. Uh, I'd say the aft cabins are about 15% larger, maybe 10% larger than the uh, than the forward cabins. Um, and uh, Unique to our boat, we have a pass-through hatch right here where uh, if uh, there's a uh, finished, uh, you, go, you could call a uh, single bed up front and uh, good for, uh, you know, a, a young child who wants his own space or something like that. We've made plenty of good pillow forts up there before. <laughs> uh, and again, it's uh, four cabins and four heads, uh, all of them with their enclosed showers. Um, come on upstairs. Did we, did we show the, uh, everything that you wanted to see on the boat? Oh, we have one more toy we can show you too, if we go to the back. Oh, yep, don't forget about the water slide. Kids really enjoy this, and even some of the adults do too. It's a blow up water slide, and right now our flamingos are playing on it. It also folds down into a floating dock if you don't want to access the slide. It's pretty fun. Pretty fun. The, uh, our, our, our flybridge is uh, mostly just a captain's uh, helm station. However, we like to, uh, we don't mind getting crew involved in the uh, sailing activities if they, if they want. Um, I've taught sailing for a number of years, so getting someone involved is uh, pretty easy to do. And uh, we can show them the ropes. And when we stack our floating docks on the top of the boat, it acts as a really nice seating area. People will bring their pillows there and look out and enjoy the view. So it's like we have our own makeshift bridge. <laughs> yeah, I think it's better. It's convertible. We can do whatever we want with that space.